All right, guys. So we got to move on, though, to one of our favorite segments. Uh, we have just added this for this season, but you can't have a lady show without some NFL drama. Man, we've had some drama this week, ladies. Matter of fact, yes, some drama have. just dropped today. Yes, oh. we have. <laughs> Man, man, man. I mean, there's a bunch of stuff that we can talk about. But so, ladies, I'm going to do the first one. Let's talk about how Brett Favre finally responds, but oh. takes no credit, no accountability for what he did, saying that it's the media that's smearing him. But I believe in the text messages that leaked, he says, what do we need to do to make sure that the media doesn't find out? Exactly. What, what the so it's the media, but it's the same people that you were worried about. You know what I'm saying? It just sounds a little fishy to me. What y'all think, ladies? It sounds like a man of, of privilege that is trying to get away <laughs> with making it sound like he's not yeah. guilty, but and like he's like Shaggy saying it wasn't me, but yeah. it was you. <laughs> and you did do this, and you yeah. did ask for he your sure did, governor to. <laughs> Take five million uh, out of a welfare fund and put it into your freaking daughter's volleyball courts and whatnot. So you can take your little privileged butt to the courts and you can fight this. And I hope your butt gets locked up in jail for the rest of your life because you did some shady shit that you shouldn't have done. I'm not laughing at the situation. I love Anthony Handy. That's all. He's, he's so good. Yeah, um, Anthony's great. Yeah. <laughs> But listen, yes, I agree. Like, we got your, like, the receipts. They're there. We got your text messages. But, of course, he has to release a statement, right? So he has to just go. I, I agree with Anthony K. He's got to go full shaggy and just keep denied, 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 <laughs> denied. Like, like, as much as possible. Absolutely. Like, you know, but I, I, I think it's wild that. But this is, this is just. Not the first time we see where this happened, where someone privileged gets busted, and then they're like, "Oh no, it wasn't me!" Like, no, yep. that's you know, uh, they try to go, they try to do like the Wizard of Oz, trying to distract you, like, "Don't look behind the curtain," right? Like, like, <laughs> like, <laughs> like, don't look behind the curtain type thing. And, it's and we're like, "No, we're gonna look, okay? We're gonna look." You see this big old giant of a person, <laughs> and then right? Look, and this little weenie little man. Yeah, we. <laughs> We're gonna that look, all right. <laughs> he did no, not he got caught. He got caught, and now he's got a backpedal. And and the thing is, like the media is so protecting him in this. Here we have uh Devontae Adams tackle the cameraman that was in his way. Literally, they showed the video. The guy walked right in front of him. He's just I think frustration. Yes, he pushed him down, but now he's got been charged and the cute like of his crime but here's brett far about here doing what he's doing and the media barely wants to cover it it's I'm not on espn baby tap, that baby tap that that adams did all week long yep. <laughs> this man steals all this money from the government right right and then what? like the whole like miles garrett thing you saw that all over the media you saw you know it's starting to look a little fishy in the media on what uh, they're choosing to cover and what they're not choosing to cover. And uh, Brett Favre deserves to be covered. Thank you. Shannon Sharp said it, man. If you guys don't watch The Undisputed, he, he called him out. He's like, look, he did 100%. I love Shannon Sharp. I love Shay Shay. Oh, <laughs> I feel like we need Anthony Handy to get I us know. He does, the best impression. he does. He does the best <laughs> impression of Shay uh, Shay ever. He does. Ever. He does. But now, nah, um, like, I agree with Kate. They RG3 said this too, and I know people were like, oh, and I'm like, okay, what they did is apples and oranges, but that's not what his comment was about. His comment was that everybody's covering, I'm going to put it out there, they're covering what black athletes have done. Yeah. Okay. They're covering black athletes' misdeeds. Yeah. But this man literally stole, stole from poor people in the poorest state. This is the poorest state in the union, okay? Yep. Barely. Literally the poorest. So if you, when you're stealing from a welfare fund, you're literally stealing from the poorest people in the country. Like, 
And so that 100% needs to be covered way more than what this has happened because that's going to go away. By the way, it came out that all this, all that Devontae's and it gives like a citation and like a thousand dollar fine or something like that. Cause it wasn't, it wasn't, Oh, he, it wasn't a saw. It wasn't that big of a deal. And basically that's what they're saying. Like when they were looking at the degrees of it, it's like a citation and he maybe has to pay a fine. Right. Like, you know, like who, like he's probably has a thousand dollars in his pocket. He could just hand over to the judge. Like, you know, like, here you go. You know what I mean? Like, I guarantee if you did that, you'd be in jail. Right. Right. Right now. So, but you know, I, I, I wish I could push down a fire. <laughs> like <laughs> as a woman, I wish I could defend myself that way because that would be great. Right. <laughs> but in any case, but yeah, so I get what we're saying. Like the the coverage of the misdeeds, it for me, yes, I think there should be more coverage. No one should let the Brett Farfee die down. He stole five no. million dollars and then put it into his daughter's volleyball team. So that's basically what we're saying. Yeah, all these, exactly, all these fools going to get this work. I agree. <laughs> yep. Right? Let's let's make sure everybody's getting equal coverage and we're talking about everybody equally. Right but to all. me, you're stealing $5 million versus a shove and then, like, you know, a punch in the face. Right. <laughs> Uh, hey, but we can segue right into that, ladies, because we also did have some more drama. It looks like Devontae Adams cannot control himself after a game and cannot politely wait till somebody can just go ahead and get out of his way. He He's ready to, to go into that one right after this one. <laughs> I love it. See, see yeah, we treat things equally, by the way, <laughs> on this show. I know. <laughs> That's not on crazy. Our Everybody gets shouted out. But the thing is, ladies, you think he's gotten concussions and, and he got a concussion. Absolutely he, not. He's back oh, no. absolutely not. What a payday. Like, what no. a payday. Like I said, it came out that like, it's not know, even, it's not even like, a, they don't even consider it a, a misdemeanor. Like it's no. not even that. Thank you. <laughs> Can Thank I just you. say, Justin Timberlake has the best song for that cameraman. Cry me a river. <laughs> Cry me. I yeah, mean, come on. So fast. <laughs> I haven't even seen somebody press charges so fast. Like, yeah. you got pushed. The very next 30 minutes, they're like, oh, that's a charge. I'm like, dang. Yep. He can't sleep. I was like, it hasn't even been 24 hours. Really? No. But this is a well, lesson. He probably had someone chirping in his ear. Go to the police. Go to the police. Absolutely. Oh, yeah, for sure. It's a lesson to Devante. You know, you can't, even though, you know, I know you're probably upset. And he shouldn't have walked right past you because he knew the right. players were through. But you got to control yourself because, like, yep. you, know, you never know who's watching. You know what I'm saying? No. Mm -hmm. know. And he did say that he felt bad about it. So, uh, I, I, I mean, I just, he apologized right away. He didn't even, like, did. take um, five I minutes. Brett Favre, accountability. I did it. And I'm going to pay the ownership for the fact that you have done what you've done. If more people took ownership for the things that they've done, this world would be a better place. <laughs> he cried harder. Oh. <laughs> oh, you did not, Kyle. You did not. <laughs> That's funny. I love you, Kyle. <laughs> oh, man. Ladies, that was funny as heck. That's funny have... as heck. You're calling okay. me Superwoman in one comment, and then you're bringing up my man in another. That's it. That's it. That's, that's, it. that's, just, that's just not right. <laughs> that's what happens when you're in, a, in the NFC South Division, right? And yep, you're a Falcons fan. But, uh, and what happened to your Falcons? Yeah, that's what I thought. Oh, um, wow. Listen, <laughs> like, I agree. Like, I think, was it taken out of proportion? Yes. I think, honestly, a friend of mine was saying, like, I bet you if you would have helped that dude up instead of walking over him and around him, it might have been a little, you know what I'm saying? Like, just at that point, right. like, just be like, oh, bro, I'm sorry, you know, like, <laughs> <laughs> like, right? I, like right there and then, like pick this, you know, pick them up and be like, I'm sorry, I didn't, you don't mean it. Like I was out of pocket, you know what I'm saying? Like something yeah. at that point. But he let too much time go by. That and let the man. He just walked past. Him. That's what I'm saying. That man went straight to the hospital because he saw the money sign in his yeah. eyeballs. He went straight to the hospital, 
Because right. I was reading the ESPN like uh, article, and they're like, he went straight to the hospital afterwards. Then Devante addressed it, but he addressed it to reporters. Like, yeah. Then he was like, oh, I'm sorry, blah, 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 blah. Now, basically, it was going to happen. He ain't going to go to jail, y'all. You, you need to relax. Come on now. This is Devante oh, Adams. Okay. He ain't going to jail. He'll pay the fine, and then he'll write a check to this man, and we'll never hear about no. this again. Absolutely. He might get a one. He might. He might get a one day suspension, though. They're saying, you know. Yeah. So, I doubt. I doubt. I doubt he'll, you know. I don't know. I think. I think they will suspend him because they suspended Mike Evans one game for punching. You know what's his name during the Saints game. But this was a light tap. Oh, I know. But I feel like yeah. they're probably. I feel like they're probably seeing it as even though that was on the field oh, as a player. I'm true. thinking that because of that incident, they might still suspend him a game just oh. to be like. Oh man, that sucks. Oh, oh. <laughs> Wait, oh, if I'm the Raiders, I'd be super like, oh my god, they're gonna suspend him because that's your guy. <laughs> you're already you're already losing games. You can't lose the fun. Right? Yeah. No more, like no more at all. But ladies, <laughs> we gotta we have to finish off the NFL drop. Let's out. go. It's too and, good today. <laughs> yes, with what happened today. Uh, Dan Snyder. Apparently, he has hired an investigator to dig into all the other owners because he don't want to be the only owner that's been put out there. You and know? he investigated Goodell, the the commissioner, too. He's investigating everybody. You He's get an investigation. You get an investigation. So we will say allegedly, my 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 it is alleged, right? My co-host Delilah always reminds me about allegedly. I have to yeah. say this: this is allegedly. But guys, does it really matter? Like, does it really matter that now you want to take the limelight off of you, which you still haven't paid the price for? Uh, you want to take the limelight off of you and now shine it on everybody else to threaten. You know what I'm saying? You and and let's get this straight: Dan has money. Dan Snyder has money. Right. But when you want to go against all 31 other teams, your money will say nothing. Like they will make no. sure that whatever you have to put out there will be shut down. Unless he leaks it like it's been happening with Gruden. Remember? That's right. It. Remember That's where it. all of a sudden these emails, all this stuff appeared yeah. and now Gruden, you know, Gruden was gone. And he said it too. Gruden was like, yeah, I might be a jerk, but he also was saying like, it ain't just me. <laughs> right? I was writing people when I wrote this stuff. Like, yeah. I writing an email to myself yeah. <laughs> right so you know i i believe i honestly like i know it's allegedly but billionaires are like that when you mess with their money and their yeah. power and their prestige they can hire all sorts of folks to dig up dirt yeah. like very yeah. easily like it's nothing to them this is pennies to these people they're billionaires right Absolutely. Right, multi-millionaires like money that we can't even like think of like it's just that type of money that they got they, right well, i said no matter what yeah you know, so like does he have to i believe him 100 percent. like that's now, will, he take down, will, will, will he take down the whole organization i agree with janae i feel like someone's gonna step in and be like well how much do you want to be quiet right <laughs> because we've seen it we've seen it right like in other, maybe not in the NFL, but we've seen when rich people get threatened, all of a sudden people start dis disappearing or oh, they're quieted yeah. or they go elsewhere. Also, you hear about it again, right? Because you're, you're threatening their money and their power. And that's something they don't want. So right. I feel like that's why he said this. Honestly, I feel like it was strategic. He's yeah. like, listen, you all either going to keep me here or <laughs> you all are going down. <laughs> Oh, definitely. Like, how do you actually believe him? You're going down, so are you willing to put everybody down with you? But also, shit? can we believe you? You yeah. won't even get what you're already accusing. Right. Can we believe what Man. you're doing? No. All right, what you think, Kate? What? What do you think, Kate, Janae? I know I have um, my piece. What y'all think? I just think he's grasping at straws right now. When you're put in a hole, you try to do whatever you can to dig out. And he's trying to dig out of this hole he's created. Because let's admit, he's trying to deflect from the fact of what he's done, why they want him out as owner, and all the women in everything he's done. So when the 
backs against the wall. You do desperate things and desperate times call for desperate measures. And he's looking like a desperate man. And he's doing everything he can possibly to save his butt. But in the end, Dan Snyder, you've done what you've done. You've you've dug your own hole. And I hope you never get out of it because those commanders deserve so much better than you. Because you're a dirty ass man. I'm sorry. <laughs> Don't apologize. You know, I think he feels like he has Robert Kraft clout. Because come on, let's oh, not he, pretend like yeah. Let's pretend Robert Kraft is not. We know what he did with with the massage parlors down in Florida. Uh, Right. So I guess, you know, I guess he feels like about it. They ain't even talking about it. Right. No. So I feel like he probably is like thinking he is something similar. But I think every time he opens his mouth, though, he makes it worse. That's really what he it does. is. You know, Robert Kraft wasn't tweeting stuff, saying stuff uh -huh. like he just was like, listen, I'm it's going to go away. I'm going to sit at the sidelines, let my I lawyers mean... handle it. Let my lawyers handle it. Anytime something comes up about Jerry Jones. Remember, like all these people came out like last month, all these women, too. You don't hear about that anymore. He's you like got children, other places. I'm telling you, when you got when you're gonna go against, you may have money. Now, don't get me wrong. Dan Snyder has money, right? But when you go against the lead, like Nicole said, yeah, country before trying to spill tea on the NFL Nation because it's too strong. Right. Right. Can't 31 other teams, they have way more money than you, and right. they can pick you up. So whatever you say. They can. I think it would dig a whole nother can of worms. I do think so. I, I think so too. I mean, he went. He went after his boy too, Jerry Jones. Right. <laughs> like best friends. <laughs> also, no. We also know that you know the NFL is holding on to things about him. Oh that yeah. We don't know. You know what I'm right, saying? Right. That's true. The they commanders have better. enough problems. They right need now. better. Yeah, they deserve better than the this. commanders have so <laughs> many more problems. And honestly, more. they should just buy him out. Like they have the money, just right. buy him out. That's what they did with Stern and the NBA, or Sterling in the NBA. Same yep. thing. They're like, you know, look what happened to the owner of Phoenix. They did the same thing. He resigned. Come on, you know, everybody's like, get out of here, bro. Like, we're done, right? <laughs> so, like, same thing. All these guys need to just get together and just push this guy out. You know, give the whole team to his wife because then she owned like fifty percent of it. And be like, here you go, get for the rest of it. <laughs> I agree. Luke. I mean. Washington has enough problems right now with their team, their record, their coach, their quarterback. Every co coach is co calling out the quarterback. They have enough problems going on. They don't need an owner that's causing more chaos for them. And I guarantee you, I know we're getting ready to end on this, but, you know, I guarantee it's not going to go down. So whatever Dan Snyder comes up with. I'm